name is Dana and today I'm going to be showing you how to um, create this word, word scramble game. So you start this, it has a timer and you can choose uh, the timer, like how much you want it. And then you ha uh, this is a scrambled word and you have to guess it. And when the timer is up, the word comes, which is bed. And then the next one, and this is actually my brother. <laughs> my small brother, he's called Amir. And this, this is um, something I watch. I'm just gonna make them fast, it's Ertogrud. And this, it's pencil, ball, clock. And yeah, I'm going to show you how to make this. But first, I need to put on a blank presentation. Now I do the layout. Uh, you right click the slide, layout, blank. Now, first of all, what you need is, a, you go to insert, shapes, and a rectangle. You make it how tall you want it. And just so you know, this is gonna be the timer, but you, so for example, if you want 10 seconds, you cannot put it like, for example, this or five seconds. No, you just make it this tall. And then I'm going to make it yellow. And now we are going to control D, so duplicate it. And then it's gonna be right here. And this one is going to be this and then shape outline go to weight and do it all okay you can you do it four uh so like four and one half put it there and then um, you have to put it just like this so you have to put the black outline on the yellow just like this uh you can also make it just like taller just like this and then Okay, I'm just gonna make it a little shorter. Okay, just make it how tall you want. Doesn't matter. And then we are going to insert pictures, online pictures, and please wait while we look. Okay, so now we need a clock. So yeah. So yeah, you need a clock. Okay, if you didn't like any one of these, like me, you can simply type cartoon clock. Just like that. Well, I'm going to be picking, don't pick one that's ringing. It will not really work with you. And don't pick a uh, like normal one. We need an alarm clock just like... Okay, we're going to be picking this one right now. Insert. Then, you make it smaller. And just like... I'm just going to give it this little turn. Yeah, like this. And we're going to make it a little more small. Or actually, I'm going to return... Uh, Just like this, but you need to have the. Uh, okay, sorry, you have to move this just a little bit. We're done. So you have to have the alarm just like into the clock, just like this. So that is what we're gonna do first, and then you're gonna press on the yellow. We're gonna make sure that's the yellow one. Okay, that is the black one. So no. Press on the yellow one. Let's see. Is that the yellow one? Yes. Okay. And then we're going to go to animations. And then um, we're going to go down. And then not the entrance. We're going to do the exit. 
and then wipe. So as you can see, it wipes up. And then effect options, that's where you go, and then you need it from right. So it'll go like this. And then right here, uh, duration, so this is 50 seconds, and that's not 50 seconds, that's like 0 0.5 seconds. But, so for example, take off the two zero. okay, just take off the whole thing, and then for example, if you want it 20 seconds, write 20.00. And then enter. enter. Now, when you uh, put it, okay. So as you can see, if you come here, and then you press one time space bar. It's getting uh, less, but it's actually really slow because it's twenty seconds. That's why I'm gonna make it ten seconds. So I'm just gonna put one, and now it's 10 seconds. So when you do this, press one space bar, and yeah, it's so much faster than the other one. But yeah, at the end you can choose whatever you want. So now that we're done with the like the timer, we're still not done because of the clock. When it's done, it will just stay still. But you will select the clock and then again stay on animations and then you will go to emphasis and then teeter okay so the clock will start doing that and then you will go to animation pane and the one that's for the picture six so for the picture maybe it's not six but for the picture you're gonna right click it and then start with pre uh, after previous so just like after this is done this will rain and here as you can see there is one box that means it will start uh, it will uh, twizzle for one time but then you will go to effect options and then timing uh, repeat three times okay okay so now, just like when you when you do this, so the timer is going 10, 9, okay, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and then it starts twizzling three times. So 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10, but there's no sound, so I might not notice it. That's why there's going to be a sound. Um, I have a sound that, um... I'm going to put the link of it in the description, but you go to insert, audio, audio on my PC, the link again you'll find in the description down below. I'm just going to go to download because I've downloaded it, yep it's right here, and then let's hear it, yeah that's how it is, and then there's like a speaker as you can see. And we are just going to put it here. We are going to put it behind the clock. Just like this on top of the clock. But I'm just going to make it smaller. I'm going to put it just like that on top of the clock. And then I'm going to put the clock. Uh, I'm going to select the clock. Right click it. And then we're going to do. Where is it again? Let's see. Actually, there's something that says uh, send forward. So let's try that again. And oh, hey, bring to front. So now that is on the back and the clock is on the front. And it won't even show, these numbers won't show in the numbers right here. Okay, the numbers are not shown. Okay, so now you start the timer. Uh, yeah, so you start the timer, and right when it's done, uh, but we need to put the sound with it, so like, start after, uh, with previous, and again, this one needs to be three times, so it can be, um, repeat three 
three times. So now let's try it. Yeah, that's how it's going to sound. So let's try it. You press the space bar for the time to start. And then it's going to go, time is running up. And they're going to be like scrambled words and everything. See? That's, oh. Uh, I think I put it four times by accident. Let's see. Uh, timing. Repeat three times. Okay, so again, let's see. And okay, one, two, three. Okay, that's correct. And now what we need is insert pictures, online pictures. Please wait while we load. Okay, now we're gonna write board. Okay, whiteboard. White board. Although we need a blackboard, so the chalkboard, we're just gonna write a bla uh, whiteboard. Actually, I don't like any of these, so I'm just gonna write cartoon whiteboard. And yeah, this is what we need. This is perfect. And then put it in, and we make it smaller. Okay, we're just gonna make it just like that. And we're gonna X this, okay. Now that this is here, we're gonna go to insert text box. And then we're gonna add a text box in, in here. And then we're gonna make the font so much bigger, yeah. And we are going to write a word. So, for example, let's say king. Until now, that's my decision. But, uh, you know what? Let's make it something easier just for the first word. So, bed. Yeah? And now that we wrote our world word, you can find any color that you want. And I'm just going to make it bigger. And I'm gonna center it. I'm gonna, okay, oops, that. Yes, bed. Actually, we'll take the bed on the side, but I'm just gonna do this because this white here, it will not show, so I want it to show here. We're gonna add another text box, and we're gonna write in it uh, the letters of bed, but in scrambled. So, for example, okay, let's make it bigger. Okay, so for, oh, oh, oh my god, that's too big. Okay. So, for example, let's say you want it edb. Edb. Because it's going to be b e d. But I just want it this way because we want it scrambled. That's the point. And center it. And now we will make it even bigger. Okay, I think this is supposed to be enough. So, we put it in the middle and then we get this. I'm sorry. This. And I'm just gonna take off the capitalization of the B and just gonna. I'm sorry. Ugh, this one, yeah. Ah, uh, I keep messing up. Okay, and we're gonna put it just right on the top. Okay? Actually, before we put it on the top, we are gonna press on this one and we're gonna okay so we're gonna select it and then we are going to go to animations and then disappear on the exit disappear and then we're gonna go to animation pane and this the text box is gonna disappear after previous start after previous and then we're gonna do the second ball the second text box the correct word and it's gonna appear and that's gonna be uh, with the previous so until now what we've done is this see it's only ed so that's like not a word, but we have to re-scramble it. And then, for example, it's, I think it's a bed. And just after this, it will turn into bed. 
but I do I want to add a picture to bed so I'll go insert pictures online pictures again please wait while we load pictures okay cartoon bed I'm just gonna write cartoon for everything because I figured out that that's the right thing okay I'm gonna choose this one and hmm I'm gonna wow okay we're gonna make this so much smaller and we're gonna just take this off. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, now we take this and we put it here. And we do this. We select it. Animations up here. And then right here, this is the one that we just did. We start with previous. So, let me show you now how it's like the timer. Let's wait. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Four, three, two, one. And then bed. Uh, it sometimes rings four times. I don't know why. But yeah, and then bed. And that's the correct one. And then you're supposed to press this uh, space bar. And then there's a... Okay, so this is basically how you do it. And if you want to do more than one, you don't have to do all that work all the way for all of them no you just press on the slide right here press on it and then hold control and then d so now you have this you just have to uh do this so for example uh i want to see the bed so the correct world you're gonna switch it with another word so for example uh anything king okay i don't know why i want king And then you're gonna, okay, you're gonna move it. And then you're gonna come here and scramble the words. So, K, uh, let's do I N K G, okay? And then you're gonna put it in the, okay, sorry, 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 that was just a mistake of me. And then you're gonna put it in the middle. And then you're gonna, <coughs> put the king on top of it and then you're gonna take this off and replace it with another pictures okay so pictures online pictures and then <clears throat> uh, what did we want a oh, cartoon king okay so this is this is the picture um this is the picture I'm choosing. So yeah, but for this time, since this picture is like big, I'm just gonna make uh, the this the text boxes a little higher so that it can fit under. Okay, just like that. We're gonna move this right here and this we'll do here but if you do this then see the picture will already be there so we don't want that what we what you will do you will just select the picture go to animations and then appear animation pan picture to with previous that's all I have to do you just change the text boxes but make sure not to mix up so the correct one put it in like so the word bed the correct word you put the other correct word in it and the other one you put the scrambled word so now in could go I don't know what that is but yeah and then you do this and then the time starts and it's ringing okay, actually let's do this okay ten nine eight seven six five four three okay that was too slow and king and you just keep doing that all the way down and thanks for watching hope you enjoyed and if you did it correctly then you're supposed to have a successful result like mine so bye, stay tuned for some awesome games in PowerPoint.